Welcome back to the range with Yoke. How y'all doing today? Y'all good? I'm great. Thank you so much for asking. So they get smaller and they get better. Today we are talking about that Banshee MK57. Super tiny, excellent uh, truck, pistol, backpack, whatever it is that you want, home defense, whatever it is that you are trying to do with something like this. Um, CMMG has done it. If you have not already heard or um, are able to tell, we are in a safe and controlled environment. We are at the gun range, the happiest place on earth. So back to what we are talking about. We are talking about that CMMG MK57 Banshee. Absolute compact, tiny, five inch barrel, 4.6, well, four pounds, six ounces, 20 inches in length, and it's shooting the 5.7 by 28 out of it. Y'all know I really enjoy that round. Um, like I said, if we can get a carry pistol with that round, some of you may beg to differ, but I would absolutely enjoy or would like to have something like that. But as far as this goes, let's do a quick uh, clear check. Um, as you can see, this little PCC is clear. And let's do a quick run through as to what it is top to bottom. On the top, we have the Vortex Crossfire Red Dot. We have uh, quite a bit of pick space at the top. We have M-Lock space, uh, three, six, and nine. Uh, we also have the CMMG. This is that fast back uh, brace on here. You have a few settings. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, it could be uh, one, two, three, maybe three, four um, settings on here. You can um, extend that, uh, make it as short as you want, whatever, uh, you can make that happen. You also do have your cutie sling, your one point sling on here. If you wanna run a two point, you just need an adapter uh, for the front to make that happen. We have the mag pull grips on here. Uh, it's not rubberized, it seems like it feels like it's a pretty standard um, grip. But mm, it's not here nor there, but for what it is that it, we're shooting and for the size of it, it's pretty qualifiable in my opinion. We are running a single stage mill, what well, not we're running, it came with a single stage mill spec trigger, standard AR functions. Now your mag release, if you look here, it's not as pronounced as I would like it to be, but it's pretty flush. So uh, to, it, it looks like it would prevent a lot of snagging of anything um, if you're trying to you know, pull that out very quickly, that could happen. We do have an ambidextrous safety on here. So if you choose to engage that from the left or the right side, you can do that. Now, your wing, it is a very nice uh, charging handle. It is um, engageable from the left side. As you can see, the hook is on the left side. And um, if you kind of force it, you'll probably drop it from the right side. But it's an extended uh, charging handle, which is nice. I do like that. But uh, there is no butts. Super nice, 5.7 by 28. The barrel is also threaded. So if you choose to run this suppress, you can do so. It's a nice shoot. We also have a um, compartment in our grip, in this mag pull grip. So if you want to put in your, you know, a couple extra rounds or screws or anything of that sort, you can. Now I got a question for you. Now this is just a question. These are opinion, and um, I would I'm interested in knowing what your opinions are uh, when it comes to things like this. Would this be something that you would choose for home defense? I know some people will say no, some people say yes, but uh, we can agree to disagree. Let's have a constructive conversation on this piece and this round. So we are shooting Federal 5.7 by 28. This is 40 grain out of this pretty little thing here. And it does come with one 20 round magazine. So 20 rounds, I feel like is a nice, uh, I mean, it's pretty decent. I wish it was a little bit bigger or they gave you a couple extra magazines, but that's not here nor there. You can always go get you a couple of those if you choose. Now, again, let's just take another <laughs> look at this because she is, we do have that Banshee um, logo engraved here and she's very pretty. I must admit, 
she is very pretty. I do wish that the mag release was just a little bit more pronounced uh, because it is quite flush. So um, just getting that muscle memory and dropping that because when you rub it, it's almost like you can't feel it. But they do put some texture on here to try to say, hey, here, 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 touch right here, touch right here. So that texture on there kind of, you know, makes that finger just go ahead and rub it so that you can drop that magazine. So with that being said, there's nothing else to say besides suit them up so we can send them down range. Now, I do enjoy this quite a bit. Um, somebody asked, well, do you have any banshees? Yes, I do. And here you go. And we are talking about that today. And you got a couple. yeah, I do. See, you always giving stuff away. We got <laughs> so stay tuned because they will. I'm going to get this camera away so somebody else can start recording your ass. Huh? I'm going to get this camera away so somebody else can start recording your ass. <laughs> Y'all don't gas him up. I know y'all got on them smiley faces, crying faces. Y'all don't gas him up. All right. So I am going to extend this just a little bit. So you would just engage and put pressure on the front side of that and just drop that to your liking. We are loaded and we have our target right beyond us. Now the magazine does load very nicely and that bolt drops nicely as well. Uh, feels good in the hand. Make sure you keep your fingers away from that muzzle because you don't want to get uh, burned or, you know, feel anything you don't want to feel. All right. Safety's on. Get these shut. Got a little one out here. All right. Now, one thing for sure, those 20 run out very quickly. The uh, boat is back, she is clear, and she is safe. Uh, I don't know, I probably did say that the magazine does load nicely because it does. Uh, so far, this is probably, uh, she favors so many. But no, this I was going to say, it's your favorite. No, 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 no. I'm not going to say that. I'm not going to say that. This is definitely in my top 10. That's better. It's definitely in my top 10 because of the round also. So, now. Okay, I got another question. What is the, I, in your opinion, what is the ideal round for a pistol caliber carbine? What is the ideal round, in your opinion? Drop that in there. If you had ability to have um, one, or if you have one and you feel like you have the ultimate setup, drop your setup and let me know what it is chambered in. Because um, although the 5.7 may not be too friendly on the pocket, but I think it is a very uh, on point round. So it's favorable for me or to me. And if you feel the same, just put agree. Put agree. Drop agree, agree in the comments. All right, let's finish loading this up. My finger a little sore. Y'all, I got stuck with a darn uh, staple. Come on, man. No, I don't care about that. Yes, I do. <laughs> and my finger's sore. All right. So heading back to the line, we are going to reload. We're going to charge and we're going to shoot. a little happy there let's switch her on safe which i can at the moment what? because we have a double feed and we have a uh, failure to eject that's our first failure and she is safe i need that round well we gotta come oh here it is all right we had a double feed we had a failure to eject and it tried to go ahead and um, ride that round. All right, she's safe. So far, so good. With that one, you know, it was minor. You were able to clear that and keep going. 
but it's all right with me. All right, so let me see. Let's try something. You ready? You ready. Wait, wait, step back a minute. Step back some. All right, you ready? Stand by. Beep. Ah, safety always gets me every time. That little steel you can't hear. But it's alright. <laughs> alright. Damn, see. I feel like you were shooting me. Why? Shells. Oh, sorry. Alright, she is safe and clear. Magazine is empty. I'm glad. I didn't even have directions and you followed them. Good job. Okay. So far, pretty good. She's moving. We had one mishap. Uh, could it be from the style of firing system that's in here? Now I do, I can feel like the, or I do feel like the trigger is having a little bit of hard time with keeping up when I actually start to shoot very quickly. So uh, that's why I'm letting up on the trigger a little bit, really not uh, dumping it. But other than that, it's a-okay with me. Yeah, my finger's so sore. Whew. Want to give him a sneak peek of the next video? No. Uh, no. Yeah, I got to come back. <laughs> Well, maybe the sneak peek will. Well, not yet, not yet, not yet. Not yet. I think you should. You think I should? All right. So y'all want to see? All right, come on. So as I was saying, somebody asked you, do you have any banshees? Yes, I do. And I also have that MK10. 10 millimeter. 10 millimeter. Now this is... So wait. Now I enjoy them both very much so. But we'll get into more details in a little bit. <laughs> so let's get back to what we were doing here. That MK57. Tiny beautiful thing. Why don't you do a little running? Start roll on the ground. <laughs> <laughs> You're joking, right? Huh? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we gonna leave that for. I run for you though. I do that. Shoot already. Yeah. Stand by. Beep. I like it. She is clear and safe. Magazine MK. All right, so far. So bueno. Me gusta mucho. Let's get a couple more magazines and keep doing it. You ready? Y'all ain't gonna catch me slipping this time. All right. Shoot already. <laughs> Stand by.
That was a good one. That was a good one. I like that one. Let's do that again. All right. And safe. Woo! Man, what was the time on that? If you had to give it a time. About 10 minutes. Oh my goodness. You don't take nothing serious. Nothing. At all. Alrighty. Oh Lord. <laughs> that was a good run. Let's do it again. All right. So last run, the magazine was not in. So we're going to load, drop the bolt, five, and go. Ready? Shoot it ready. Stand by. Beat. Um, About 11 minutes. Come on. All right. Say, let's do it again. I like it. And because she's so light, it feels really nice. All right. So this last one, I'm going to have the magazine already in. Uh, so all I'm going to have to do is drop the bolt and um, engage safe or fire and then go i hope y'all keeping time drop them time drop them drop them okay let's get these 20 in and do it again every time i um say do it again it reminds me of this song i got another it's probably a lot of them, but let's do a little trivia. Okay. He's not a very popular reggae artist, but there's a song that has that do it again. Let's do it again. If you know who I'm talking about, drop that in the comments. All right. All right. So we are ready. So I'm just waiting on you. Drop the bolt and shoot. Shoot already. <laughs> Stand by. like that one was good <laughs> she is clear and safe I don't feel like that was good what do you think well okay we only have a few left so we're gonna run it slowly so we're gonna two first target two second target and then we're gonna come back to why don't you jump over these barrels Two, last target. All right. Jump over the barrel? Yeah. All right. I'll do that when I get to the blue one. I'll jump over the blue one, not the beige one. See, it's much taller. <coughs> Let's go. <laughs> All right. Shoot it ready. Stand by. Oh man, that was nice. She's clear, safe, and empty. Oh, I like it. All right, so 
we are talking about that CMMG Banshee MK57. What a great shoot. I enjoyed it. We had fun. She's lightweight. Uh, of, of course, that 5.7 round to me is great. It's a super fast, uh, very accurate, in my opinion, round. And this little guy here really performed great and um, showed me a good time today um, at the range. So what did y'all think? What did y'all see? Do you have one? Let me know. Drop that in the comments. Let me break this down just a little bit more for you so you can see how tiny this is. Isn't it the cutest thing ever? <laughs> All right, yo, gang, listen. Listen, I do not have a TikTok. I do not have a WhatsApp, and I do not have a Telegram, so please stop entertaining these scammers. And with that being said, make sure you check out www.yokegang.com. Pick up a t-shirt or a patch or even join the Yoke Gang All In. Uh, hit the link. Come on over. Um, let's have some fun. So, uh, again, y'all already know I love it when things work, but I love y'all for life. Mm.